Hi, this is thing Today, I would like to share how to check and uncheck all check boxes on user form with one click. Okay, let's go to developer tab. Look for Visual Basic. Now we create a user form with check boxes. So let's say we have a few options here. Okay, the first one, let's say we put it as A. So we can change under the caption here. If let's say we can we want to change the font size, we can change here and then we want to decorate, means I give some colors, we can change over here. Then this is the name or the code for this checkbox. We have to make sure that when we run the code, before we run, before we write the code, we have to make sure the numbering is consecutive. The sequence is not important, but we have to make sure the number is consecutive, meaning to say it must be one two three or four five six okay must be consecutive cannot like jumping so one then two missing jump to three if not this will raise up an arrow okay the second one we have for example like you change to b okay then the third we put it as c and what we want here our intention is to check all check boxes with one click so we need one checkbox that can check the above so we will type all the above okay so by using this we have to make sure that the one that going to check for others is the number that either the smallest or the largest so for this case i will use this at largest so the others will be consecutive okay so we double click on this then what we have to do here is if let's say the user check the checkbox number four so we have checkbox four dot value equal to two true so if let's say being checked means that the value will be true then we have to run through all the checkboxes and then we check it so we have i equal to one two three okay what we have to do here we will make use of the user form one dot controls so we control the check boxes so we have check box make sure the spelling is correct and then the capital letter for b and c the syntax is important then we use emphasis to connect the variable by we don't write the user form checkbox over here because we want to run the checkboxes using the variable i so we have to use controls so dot value equal to true okay so done for the first one then we move on to the next one so we have next i start with if then we end with if okay done already now let's see the result so we go to the user form let's run and save so as we can see if we click on the first use first option the a okay others will still remain unchecked how i click on c still are unchecked okay now i uncheck all i check this all the above so as we can see it being checked so how if let's say we want to reset means that we don't want the all the above we want to select again then we go back to the visual basic okay we double click all the above okay we can try how let's say we make it like or make it the checkbox value for checkbox number four is equal to false so we have false equal to false okay so we run and see so we run okay we click okay click and click so as you can see so we click on all now we uncheck so can as we can see all unchecked being unchecked at the same time 
So if let's say you worry that the user after check all, then accidentally press and then make the user want to select again, actually we can create a reset button instead of putting the code in here. So we just go back and then we cut this code. Okay, now we go to user form and create a reset button. So click on insert command button okay let's say we go to caption and change to reset okay we can decorate if we want so make it in purple color okay so we double click on this then we paste the code over here so if let's say the value is false then equal to false so or we can straight away just make it reset means that everything back to origin before we select anything so we just run from the first to the fourth okay then we'll do okay so we go back to user form and then we run and see so we have one by one okay all at the same time even i click here now as we can see no more learn no more like i check all at the same time so we click on reset okay everything being reset okay that's all for today thanks for watching hope you like this see you